Did you see the new Pepsi Colat shop? <laughs> what is the, the new what? It's giving free Shavakadu? Pepsi Colat shop? It's a thing? Yeah, but I don't even know what is it. What is it? Is it a drink? Is it business or pleasure? Don't flatter yourself, Karen. You down. It's Pepsi flavored ketchup? Why is it called Colach up then? I'm wearing purple gears, which means I can't upgrade it. Okay, well, you're useless to me then. Because it's Pepsi Cola plus ketchup. Oh, okay. I don't know about all that, man. It's. Do you think God stays up in heaven because he's scared of what he created on earth? They've tried to gobble me up on more than one occasion. Why do they despise me so? I created them. Do you think God stays in heaven because he too lives in fear of what he's created? Here on earth? It's crazy that there's a line from Spy Kids, huh? Spy Kids 2, actually. I'm resisting all, a lot of temptation to make an Austin Powers joke. <laughs> Spy Kids is proof of auteur theory, for sure. Those movies are just, like... Do you think it was wise to It's like together? Robert Rodriguez's, like, seem, psyche on the screen. I needed his eyes, and no. I want to hate, uh... That he does. Robert Rodriguez, like, so much. Because I... Okay, I'm not trying... I'm not being that serious. I think in my head, my headcanon version of Robert Rodriguez is actually who Zack Snyder is in real life. So I was like, oh, I don't really like the movies this guy makes. I'm sure he's going to be, like, insufferable. And then I watched that episode of The Chef Show where John Favreau goes over to his house and they just cook, like, a bunch of pizzas. And he just seems like a really nice guy. And I was that made me, like, even angrier. I was like, fuck you. <laughs> you should be more of a dick. Me when I hate on Megan Trainer. I know, because you can't just be a hater in the modern era, right? In the modern era, you're not, elect to, you're not allowed to like anything that's made by bad people. The and end. the corollary to that is you're not allowed to hate someone unless they deserve it. <laughs> Come on. You can't just... It used to be back in the day, people were going crazy. They were hating on, like, Barney the Dinosaur. You'd be like, why are people so mad about... Adults would be like, fuck Bar Barney the dinosaur, I hope he dies. You'd be like, why? They'd be like, I don't know, purple? He's purple? He sings, I love you, you love me? Nowadays, you'd be like, oh, I don't really like uh, Barney the dinosaur. Oh, really? Yeah, I know. Like, he's not... The show's not that great, but he donates, uh, like, millions of dollars to charitable causes. So, actually, you're... The fuck him, he's purple, dude. You're purple? I'M LAVENDER! I hate media based on- I hate people based on my taste in media. It's my most boomer-coded trait. Dude, I hear you. I mean, I wouldn't say I hate, like, Megan Trainer or, like, John Legend or anything. But, like, I'll be real with you. You might think this is putting on airs. But, like, if I was in the grocery store and someone was like, Hey, dude, check it out. I don't want you to miss out. John Legend is over in, like, the dairy aisle. Why don't you go meet him and get his autograph? I would not, unless I was already going to the dairy aisle, I would not walk over to see him. I think, <laughs> maybe this is biased, but I feel like you're kind of a dick if you take a photo with a celebrity whose work you don't actually enjoy. Like if you hate Seth Rogen, but you see him in public and you recognize him, and you go, Seth Rogen, can I get a picture and an autograph? I think that makes you kind of a dickhead. You took someone else's time just to be like, check it out, I got a photo with someone whose face I recognize. You did it You did it for clout, exactly. What if I tell him he sucks afterwards? That's definitely even worse. That's not based. I would definitely be pissed off if someone was like, are you NL? And then they took a photo and then they're like, by the way, like I hate all your work, Chibli's better. I would be like, okay, bye. Rude ass. The dude's probably... You do that to Seth Rogen. The dude's probably out there just... Buying a pot. 
Oh, sorry, he makes his own pot. Okay, that, I forgot he was into pottery now. He's probably out buying weed or something like that. You're going to ruin his day You're telling him you didn't like sausage party? What did they say? Keep up the good work, you fucking freak? Hey, I've been watching a long time. I remember when you sucked off 16 cops in a row.